Hello, this is Dr. Victoria Skirmo speaking to you from the Caesar Transformation Healing Center in Wareham, Massachusetts. Today is Tuesday, December 25th, 2018. Merry Christmas for those of you who celebrate Christmas. Happy holidays for uh, everybody else. Um, today the moon is in Leo. It's a, it's a nice moon for Christmas, I think, because uh, Leo has uh, at its core a, a generous spirit, and so we feel more generous, more loving, uh, if not a tad dramatic. So expect a little drama, but expect a whole lot of love today. Um, there's a lot of aspects going on between the moon and all the other planets, and so um, to go over them all is um, would be tedious. Suffice to say um, that we will have challenges today. Um, those challenges are mostly, um, they kind of have to do with how best to uh, move forward in life. There is a need for forgiveness. There is a need for compassion. Um, even uh, and maybe perhaps especially for those who you don't necessarily agree with. Um, things are still not quite clear. We still have that Mercury-Neptune uh, square that's uh, in aspect still, although it's past exactitude, and we're still in that place. Now, there's a certain amount of, we'll say, illusion when it comes to Christmas anyway, uh, because I think a lot of us have uh, experiences around the holidays that don't ne necessarily jibe with the um, the fantasy of what it's supposed to be. And so to a certain extent we can feel cheated or feel like uh, that wasn't my experience, it's supposed to be something else. What's interesting is that the sun is in Capricorn um, at Christmas and, and there's um, Capricorn spends a lot of time saying shoulda. So, <laughs> but the South Node is in Capricorn now, and uh, actually uh, very close to the to the uh, Pluto, uh, Pl uh, America's Pluto, interestingly enough, and we can see some of the structures of power uh, being challenged and crumbling, and uh, it's a very interesting time, I guess, how we could say that. Anyway, not to get too political at Christmas, but um, it's there. I mean, it's all happening now, right? Um, and so today really is about searching your heart um, and remembering that at the core of things, love is the ultimate healer. And uh, no matter who you are or what you've said or what you've done, uh, you deserve love. And uh, that's true of uh, each uh, of us as individuals, uh, collectively, whatever, you know, collective group of people that you might have an issue with. Um, it really does come down to love. We're here to learn love. And, um, you know, Christmas is a time of birth or perhaps rebirth. The rebirth of the sun, the, the, the sun rises, at least in the, in the northern hemisphere, and each day gets a little bit lighter and lighter. And so we have reached the nadir, the darkness of the darkness. And now we slowly, slowly move back into the light and, uh, And we'll, we have each other. Don't forget. <laughs> okay. All right. Have yourself a, a blessed and uh, wonderful Christmas. Uh, stay in your heart and uh, love one another. And I want to give everybody a, 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 a gigantic thank you from me. This has been a journey. I've been on YouTube for a long time, so years, um, but I didn't really... Um, I guess catch fire till a few months ago after my first uh, uh, my first card reading on um, Christine Blasey Ford and uh, and um, Kavanaugh and and then the floodgates opened. So I want to thank you for all your comments. I want to thank you for all the love and uh, and appreciation that you give me. It helps me. It helps me. Um, to feel like I'm contributing 
and that uh, perhaps I can make the world a better place. And I know together we can do it. So thank you very much for that opportunity, and I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye.